All right, so picture this. You load into a woods raid, you've just spawned in, you're good to go. You head to a nearby camp for loot, jump the fence, nice and easy. You start looting up, then you head off into another direction. That looks like a dead bloke. Ooh, suspicious. You get a bit closer, take another look. But then what happens? Uh oh. Oh! <laughs> Pavel Borgor. <laughs> Ouch. We've all been there this way. The scav was cracked, and I was simply too slow. Regardless of if it was a scav or a PMC though, today I'm going to show you a little something that will help make your engagements a little more swift and concise. And guys, before we jump into this one, if you're enjoying the content, please hit that subscribe button. So anyone that's been following my content for a while now will know that I'm a massive fan of fixed optics. And one we'll be revisiting today is the Monstrum 2X. Oh, that's a bush. All right. Oh. Sorry, why is that the tankiest Timmy I've ever shot? I'm using BS ammo, by the way. Reloading. So with more restrictions cracking down on scopes, there's a much bigger demand for folks looking for semi-budget options for their builds. And I think this might just be the one you're looking for. This guy was giving me the runaround, and although he was naked, we still had to respect that he's somewhat dangerous. His movement was pretty good after all. He seemed to be doing a pretty good job of duking me. And I know you're probably watching this and thinking, it's really awkward not having a red dot in this scenario, but it's not. Hip firing in Tarkov is really strong. Being able to move faster while shooting is a big advantage, and I don't think enough people realise that. Not to mention, I've used this scope so much at this point that I'm comfortable with what distance I can scope in and start tapping people at. But you'll see that a bit more throughout this video. Where did the Timmy go? Dude, that guy almost got me. Dude, three shots to the chest with BS ammo. What is BS ammo? Why is it so donkey? That encounter was a little scarier than it should have been, but we made it out either way. So I started looting up these blokes and headed on to somewhere else. Win. What the? Reloading. Hello, GI fucking scav. Oh, if I wasn't awake now, I am. Reloading! Sorry bro, too slow. Early one gets the worm. Hang on, that's not the right sign. Hurry worm gets the worm. This guy was juiced. And that kill right there is one of the biggest reasons why I love the Monstrum. Screw variable scopes. Too slow, too much effort. This thing is fast. It's as simple as point and click. And the wonderful thing about Tarkov is it doesn't matter if you're moving about. If your reticle is on someone's head and you shoot, the chances are they're gonna fall over. And this 2x scope makes abusing that mechanic so much easier. I do feel sorry for that guy though. He was crouched up and aimed down sight and he still lost the angel. 
Thank you for the prime sub, mate. Welcome on in. Little cheeky money making tip on the side here, if you haven't noticed, I'm hitting up all the saves on customs. In my opinion, this is still one of the best ways to make money early game. A lot of people just have this massive fear of dorms and tend not to go there, so you're either going to find an absolute chad and it'll probably kill you, or there's just going to be nobody there or people questing, you know? So buy the keys, hit up these safes, they're really cheap and they will make you a lot of money. Okay. I love safes. I feel really bad about killing that guy. It was just unfortunate timing on his part, and honestly, it could have been either one of us. That's unfortunate. I'm just hovering around for a second in case there's another one nearby. Better to be safe than sorry, you know? You don't know if he's got a partner or not. I just killed another Timmy. Honestly, at this point, maybe I did deserve getting one tapped by that scab earlier. Oh no, of course it's not open. After the amount of luck I've had, there was no way I was going back for the other body. It was straight to the extract for me. Alright, I don't know what half of this loot is, but... Oh, dude, the safe loot is insane. Oh, what the f... Well, I killed five people. On to the next raid now, and we're on Woods, this time continuing on with the Punisher questline. He's got like a really light blue. Good night. Okay, I'm sorry bro. Yep, definitely going to hell in my next raid. He had a quick raid. That must have been all of 23 seconds. That Sturman, for the first time this wipe, unbelievable. I'm sure I heard a guy here. Uh oh. I said I wasn't going to go here, but I've just lied. Oh, meat stick. Well 
Oh oh. What the f What we do? Right, there's somebody shooting at me. Um, uh, yeah. Little bit scared. Don't really know what to do here. Sturman's kind of eating me. Huh? Where? Tell me. Uh, I'm literally being shot at through a rock. Okay, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Yeah. Like, literally, you will die. If anyone goes there, they die. You have to shoot him from, like, miles away if you want to kill him. Reloading! Dude, that scab just did not want to die. You see that? He's made of an iron buckin, bro. Just want to check Violet. Alright, no. Okay, we move. We move. We go to Usec or something. Wait, where was that? Is that sniper scav? No, it sounds like a Mosin man. Do we do we go? You say oh, maybe we, maybe we do. It's just there's a Mosin man at Spine. I kind of want to go there. Oh, I wish I had a good angle for this man. Oh yeah, there's a guy right there. This guy was looking like he was going to disappear in the trees in a matter of seconds, so I took this small window of opportunity to reposition. to god oh wait i've just walked away with no mag in my gun i'm so good what the f is that a player oh no sunken okay okay See me legs go burr. Oh my god. Reloading. Fucking hell, the hordes of Timmies are coming out of nowhere. I absolutely love this scope for those types of engagements. Sometimes it really is just a battle of who can headshot who first. And this scope is so cheeky for those types of fights. The problem with Tarkov for a lot of people is there's so many options, so many ways to build your gun. And I see a lot of people struggling with optics. People really make it harder for themselves. So if you're feeling uncomfortable with what to put on your gun, try this out. You might find it really helps to improve your aim like it has for me. I popped an SJ6 earlier with the intention of coming here because I heard a bunch of shots. Turns out it was probably just these scabs having a laugh. Oh, there were shots here, but I think it was just scabs, man. So many people. Alright. Reloading! 
carrier moving. I'm pretty sure there's shots at uh, Scav Town. I had finished my quest at this point, but honestly, I was just greeting this raid as much as possible. Okay, so there were shots here. I'm gonna get free tap this time. Yeah, I'll try, man. Don't die to floating magic men. Don't die to floating Mosin men with no muzzle flash. Don't die to Kim Kardashian. Don't die to the Claymore. Uh, don't die to the Scav. 1-800 head eyes. Don't die to... Uh, I don't know. Miss anything? Looks like I just missed whoever was killed this guy. Been gone quite a while by the looks of it. Alright, well, nothing much we can do now. Am I hearing somebody? Yeah, there's definitely a guy here. Reloading. Man didn't hit a single shot. True, but look at his gun. Reloading. How am I still in need of food and water? Alright, well, I'm gonna eat the sausage. I've always wanted to see the animation. Oh. Ugh. Hmm. Bit weird. Right, Bitcoin, please. You might have forgotten I zoomed off pretty quick after killing these guys to see if there was anyone at Sunken. Time to loot up and get out of here. Oh no. Twenty K, alright, it's ten K slot. I'll drop that if I need. This guy didn't have a backpack. Why? Why you do this? I'll just drop my mag. Okay, I only need one. I swear buckwheat's not worth it, is it? Yeah, probably not. All right, time to get out. All right, good ride. Killed many blokes. Oh. Alright, well, that was a good raid. Lads, thank you so much for watching till the end. Please, subscribe. And if you found these tips useful, then you won't want to miss out on this video right here.